Good morning. Today is Friday, May 17th. I am 10 weeks post-op and I'm feeling great. Um, I cannot believe that I have lost over 71 pounds, y'all. That, that's crazy. For me, That I feel like that's crazy. Um, I'm going to get into the stats. Um, for those of you who are following for the first time or watching for the first time, my name is Sue Lady, also known on Instagram as Sue Lady VSG and on YouTube as Sue Lady VSG. Um, I had vertical sleeve gastrectomy done on March 8th, 2019 with Dr. Salcedo at Pompeii Surgical in Tijuana, Mexico. My highest weight on February 1st of 2019 was 311. My surgery uh, weight was 285 on March 8th, 2019. And currently today, I weigh 239.4. Crazy. I feel amazing. By the way, I'm going to start driving and I'll give you guys my little card ride chronicles as per usual. Um, I'm, I'm feeling great. I did on my previous nine week post-op video that I just posted, um, I put at the end of the video some before and after photos. So if you want to go check that video out, you guys can see my before and afters. Um, so yeah, just ride along with me and I'm going to talk to you guys about my 10 week post-op. Got my juice my juice of the day my juice of the day is mango pineapple passion fruit with one fourth cup of orange fresh squeezed orange juice and the rest water with three to four packets of natural erythritol uh, stevia I also add in my liquid vitamins I have a Tespo um, vitamin liquid dispenser where you put a pot in, like a Keurig. You put a pot and you fill it up with water and then it dispenses a little like one ounce shot of juice. Um, and it works really good for me. I haven't had any problems and my, my levels are all really, really good. So, and my blood work came back normal uh, and it's, it's very good. I don't have any complaints as far as my liquids. Uh, vitamins and I do it all in this by the time I get to work I'll be almost done with this um, and it doesn't taste like anything it just tastes like juice like like a smoothie um, now a lot of people have uh, mentioned that fruits are not the best to have because they're high in sugar and I agree a lot are like for example if you have a small little halo mandarin or clementine it has like tons of carbs and all that other jazz. However, nobody ever got fat off of having fruits and veggies. I believe that I'm 10 weeks post-op. I haven't hit a stall, thank God. I haven't hit a stall yet. And I hope I don't. Excuse me. However... I've been doing the smoothie every day and I've been intaking about 1,000 to 1,200 calories a day and I haven't hit a stall like I, I don't really I don't really listen to everyone's journey and I'm not saying that in a bad way but I want y'all to know everyone's journey is not going to work for you if someone says don't try this it doesn't mean that you shouldn't if you want to try something, try it. You have to listen to your body. Now, I'm not saying to scuff down, you know, burgers and cookies and stuff. However, if you if you want to try to do like shakes or vitamins or this or that, the way that you want to try it, go for it and try it. Um, for me, I've done two years of research prior to VSG on nutrition and how the body absorbs and I've just done my work and my research. I've spoken to multiple doctors. I've gotten advice from professors. Like I spoke to my own doctor. I've picked brains of different doctors. Like I've, I've tried to do, and I'm not perfect and I'm not saying I have all the answers. However, I haven't hit a stall. I'm 10 weeks post-op and I lost 70 some odd pounds. 
So with that being said, I'm going to continue doing what I'm doing. So, you know, sometimes people like DM me like, oh, I thought we weren't supposed to. I'm like, well, you, you might not be able to. Not everybody can, but this is what works for me and this is what I'm going to continue doing. So do whatever works for you. My channel is really just to tell you guys what I'm doing and to document my life on this journey. It's not really to appease everyone. And I don't mean that in a bad way. It's just that's what it is. Anyway, um, other than that, I'm feeling great. I'm losing pounds, dropping inches. Um, yesterday was my last day of classes uh, for the spring 2019 uh, college semester um, I decided to take the summer off because I want to focus on working out and I start um, working out with a bariatric weight loss uh, workout group next week Tuesday I'm very excited about that um, my gym has a program. I mentioned it in my video before, and I'm starting that next week. I'm also starting with a personal trainer on Monday. That is going to be exciting as hell, and I am going to be videotaping some of it. Not everything, but some of it I will, and I'm, I'm really super excited about it. I can't wait. I really feel that I'm ready for the weight loss um, as far as the weight loss journey part of the workouts. I know it's going to be hard in the beginning, but I know I can do it. And I know that I could stall because when your body starts working out, sometimes some weird funky stuff happens where, you know, you have to balance out your caloric intake with your calorie, um, you know, what your, what, you, what your deficits are. And you have to balance out how much calories you lose with how much calories you intake. So I'm definitely going to be monitoring all of that and making sure that... I go into the proper deficit as opposed to just burning muscle at one point. Um, and I feel really, really good. Anyway, I, today's going to be a short video. I just wanted to give you my stats, tell you guys where I'm at. Um, and yeah, also, I am going to be doing a get ready with me video, most likely on maybe Sunday. I, I was requested to do like little makeup videos. However, I know there are a lot of men on here who most likely look at my videos and however, I know there are men on here that also look at the videos and I'm pretty sure they don't want to look at me getting ready. However, for my women who want to see the little makeup tutorials and stuff, I'm going to do a chit chat get ready with me where I do my makeup and I get myself all ready while talking about some challenges and some topics on weight loss just to make it you know something everybody can watch and I do want to stick to weight loss on this channel um, anyway I hope you guys are having a wonderful wonderful week uh, this is my 10 week post op and I'm feeling great thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys this weekend bye